I'm wedding and portrait photographer Vanessa Joy, and I'm here to introduce you to two new products by Data Color: the Spider X2 Ultra and the Spider X2 Elite. tools are color calibration monitors. If you're not familiar with monitor calibration, what this tool does, it calculates the color coming from your monitor as well as the ambient light in the place where your monitor is to make sure that your monitor is giving you perfect luminance and color. So that while you're editing photos, you're not editing them to an errored screen that's maybe a little bit too warm or a little bit too magenta. Instead, it is absolutely picture perfect to the true colors that that they need to be. This makes it a lot easier for you to edit photos. It makes it easier for you to print photos accurately so that they're exactly what you want them to be as the creative photographer that you are. The brand new Data Color Spider X2 makes it super, super simple. If I'm gonna be truly honest, the first time I did this, I didn't read any of the instructions. I was able to calibrate my monitor perfectly with the instructions that they have right in the software. Data Color has updated the software so it's even easier to use than before. Like I mentioned, I didn't read any manual. I just walked myself through it and had absolutely zero problem with how easy it was to read and figure out what to do next and get a perfectly calibrated monitor. I personally have the Spider X2 Ultra and using it was simple. The first step was downloading and installing the brand new software, answering a few questions about what kind of monitor I had. And don't worry, if you don't know the answers to these questions, the new software walks you through it with some suggestions and information to help you figure out what the best calibration settings are for you. The next step is to place the spider device in the designated spot on your computer monitor. It'll take a series of measurements to help you build that ICC profile and adjust for the brightness of the room that you're in, which is really key. When all those measurements are completed, you just remove the sensor and it's done for you. And it's really fun looking at the before and after because you don't see exactly how off your calibrated monitor is or non-calibrated monitor is until you do that before and after. So I probably sat there for entirely too long going back and forth. I'm using an Apple cinema display and in my head, and this is probably not the best line of thinking, in my head, my Apple display perfectly color calibrated. Uh, wrong. No, they're not. The before and after definitely showed me that. Some of the differences between the Elite and the Ultra, let's break those down for you so you know which one is going to be the best tool for you. The Elite is perfect for photo, video, hybrid work, digital design, content creation, and good whether you're just starting out or a professional. But the Ultra is meant for HDR high brightness monitors from 750 to 2000 CDM or NIT. So if you're someone that's working with a higher power monitor, you're probably going to want the Ultra versus Elite. There is a small price difference between the two of $30 with the Ultra coming in at $299 and the Elite at $269, at least at the time of this recording. You can look through my YouTube channel. Data Color is a fantastic, really a staple photography company. I've been using things like the color checker that you take photos of the grid of colors and helps you make sure that the photos are color balanced perfectly. I've been using their color calibration tools for quite some time. And then I have a really fun video actually using their color reader to choose a color off of something and then play with the background. Anyway, I'll show you all the links to all the videos, but Data Color is a solid company. They've been around forever and they help us photographers and videographers get beautiful, consistent color throughout different cameras, throughout different displays. It's definitely stable in any professional photographer's closet. Make sure you check out the link to look at both the Spider X2 Ultra and Elite. See which one is better for you and let me know what you think about calibration in the comments. Is this something that you do? Hit like, subscribe, ring the bell, and I'll see you next time.